What's going on, everybody? Here, welcome back to some more Asher Deer. Hopefully, you're having a little day. I'm having fantastic days today. We're gonna okay. So this is what I want to do. I want to get things done. We got things. To, we got a lot of stuff to do here. But we're moving at an incredible speed, and I feel like we're doing a lot of a little of everything, and not like fully doing anything. So we're gonna pump the brakes. We're gonna slow down just a hair, and we're gonna focus on what we need to do. And what we need to do today, first of all is swap out the costume. We gotta get some new colors in here. Let's get a new palette. You know what? I'm feeling I'm feeling OG for a little bit. Let's go with um Where is where's OG? Is it is it heavy orange? It's not heavy orange. Where's the OG colors? Where's where's our where's our OG? Exo orange. We're gonna go with I don't think exo orange is the normal one. I actually don't think it is. And we're not gonna have a hat. Wait, this isn't the right color. The backpack is not the right color. Is this the right color? I don't know. We're going to rock this one for a little bit. Anyways, the goal, the plan, I think, um, coming into this, I was thinking about this. I know it's a scary thought. I think we need to go. I think it's time for the large shuttle. I think we need to get the large shuttle. I think we need to get the hydrazine going. I think we need to get the refuelability and being able to get from planet to planet a little bit easier, getting rid of the uh, the throwaway, um, the throwaways for the, for the thrusters and stuff. So... Um, yeah, we're going to go ahead, titanium alloy, a ceramic times one, and then what do we need for our hydrazine thruster is steel and exochips. Okay, so steel is what we needed because that's what we need. Oh, we're going to need methane for silicon. Um, okay, we're going to need steel, which is iron, carbon, and argon, which we did just get. Oh my gosh, this mess down here. It's terrible. Um, I have some argon, and we should have some iron. I'm going to go ahead and just do that. So let's see here. Iron, carbon, argon. Um, we're going we're to need carbon first. So let's go ahead and grab some carbon. I'm going to make two of these because I think we're going to need something else too. Um, and then we need some iron. So there's an iron, and then there is an iron right there. And we're going to go ahead and put this. Oh. Put that back on there. Put that back on there. Okay. So let's go ahead and make a steel for that now. Um, and then we need a titanium alloy and ceramic for the large shuttle. Okay. So give me that steel. I'm going to go ahead and make another one. And then what did we need for here? Steel and an exo chip. Guess what? We've got plenty of exo chips right now. Boom. Exo chip. Steel, hydrazine thruster, fantastic. That bad boy is doing its thing. Now, I'm gonna go ahead and take the steel and throw it over here for now. And then what we need is titanium alloy. Nitrogen, graphene, and titanium. Okay. So we have nitrogen. We need titanium and graph. Oh, we need graphene. Okay, so hold on. Graphene is graphite and hydrazine. Okay, so we need hydrazine. Where's our hydrazine right here? Okay, hydrogen, uh, ammonium, and ammonium. Okay, so that is what we need for that. There's an ammonium. I don't know that I actually have uh, enough ammonium right now. Huh. I don't think I do. Is ammonium available in here? Oh yeah, it is, but it's a, it's at a rate of one per soil canister, isn't it? That's terrible. <laughs> That's just an awful ratio. So. Let's do this. Let's go try to get some ammonia, but we're gonna take a uh, we're gonna take a canister with us here. What do we need to build in order to get a canister? We're gonna go and set that on there. So if I wanted to get a canister, I'm pretty sure it's in here, right? Yes. Uh, medium resource canister is plastic and glass. So let's go ahead and swap to plastic real quick. Carbon and compound. So there is a carbon. Do I have a compound on me? No, I don't. Okay. So let's grab a compound. Get that on there. Let's go ahead and get a plastic going. We're going to get another one of these. We're going to go grab some ammonium with it. Uh, we're going to put it on the back of the of our of our drilling drillinator over there. And then it was uh, what was it? Plastic and glass. OK, so there's the plastic and then glass. Do we have a glass over here somewhere? We've got to have a glass somewhere, right? Yes. Okay. So we got a glass right there. All right. So let's get that. 
Uh, that's not the way I need that, apparently. <laughs> okay, so there's that, and I'm going to take this ammonium to mark this as the um, the container for ammonium. So we're going to go get some ammonium so we can get hydrazine. We need hydrazine in order to get graphene. We need graphene in order to get titanium alloy. We need titanium alloy in order to get the large shuttle, which we need. Because we need to be able to go from planet to planet and get stuff. Um, I don't know. We'll see how this goes. Because we need some other things too. And I want to craft some other things, but we're going to need gases. So having the large shuttle will actually allow us to get power. That is not what I wanted on there. <laughs> I just realized that. Okay, let's put this on here. All right, so this is ammonium. And let's go ahead and let's go find some ammonium. Now, um, yes, so we need to be able to go from planet to planet and get gas without having to set up gas um, stations on each planet. We will eventually set up gas stations on each planet, but for now, I just don't, I just don't think it's, it's, you know, it's prudent to do that yet. Uh, we'll do that in the future, but for now, I just want to have, I just want to be able to take a gas or an atmosphere condenser with me to the other planet, grab a little bit of the gas we need, head back, you know what I mean? So that's gonna be our goal here. Now I gotta find hydrazine or ammonium because ammonium can be a little finicky to find sometimes. It's supposed to be in these hills, but sometimes it's like, like I said, sometimes it's like it likes to play hard to get. Uh, is that? I don't see any there. I see compound. I see lots of compound. I don't see. Oh, here we go. Here's some right here. Perfect. All right. There we go. Oh my gosh, look at all the look at all the ammonium. This is what I'm talking about. Let's go, baby. Suck up all that ammonium deliciousness. Mm-hmm. Absolutely amazing. Alright, let's go ahead and dig down here a little bit. Uh, back up a little bit further. There we go. Lots of ammonium. Very nice. Is there any more? Is that it? Oh, there's still more deeper. Wow. Actually surprised at how deep this resource node goes. Like this is a good node here. You know what we should do? Oh man. You know what we really should do? I don't know if we have the stuff for it right now. Hold on a second. Let me look. I don't think we do. We really should set up a thumper. Um I haven't used one of these since they first came out. And I was kind of on the fence about them. Um, but the auto extractor, exochip, steel, tungsten carbide, and rubber. That is actually not a terrible thing because it, it gets like all of these resources like this without destroying the ground. Um, maybe have to, eh, it might be in the future. We got we got half of we got half of one of these canisters right here full of ammonium already. So that'll be enough ammonium for what we need for now. Uh, actually, it'd probably be enough ammonium for what we need for a little while anyways. All right, come with me, ammonium. We must turn you into hydrazine, a very useful and explosive resource. Oh, yes, hydrazine is explosive. <laughs> hey, hey, you put that on my back. Quit that. Okay. So. Chemistry lab. Okay, so let's go ahead and take some ammonium out of here. I'm not going to I'm not going to throw it all on here yet. So I need. Hydrazine. Okay, so there's our hydrazine. And then we need hydrogen, which is right here. There we go. All right. So go ahead and make that. And then we need to make graphene. Do I have any graphite? Oh, I have one. Uh, fuel for thought. Heck yeah. Look at that. Okay. Now I'm going to put that in there and then we're going to swap this to graphene. So there's graphene and a hydrazine. And then we're going to need... What do we need for the VTOL? I just realized that. I just saw a thing that said vertical thoughts. Um, we don't have silicone yet. Okay. 
All right, that's what we need. We need the silicon. Okay, so there's graphene. So now we need titanium alloy, which is titanium, graphene, and nitrogen. Mm. We have hydrogen. Do we not have nitrogen here? I thought we had nitrogen here. Wait a second. Where's my... Hold on. Shuttle. Wait a second. I left my atmospheric condenser on the other planet. Didn't I? I sure did. I sure did. I absolutely did that indeed. That was the thing that I absolutely did. <laughs> okay. Uh, atmospheric condenser, plastic, glass, and iron. Okay, well, that's not too bad. So, well, that's kind of a poop. That's kind of, that's kind of a hydrogen. I thought we were producing nitrogen. We have argon. Oh, there's nitrogen right there. Okay. I was like, wait a second. I was like, I'm almost positive we have this. Okay, so there's the, there's that. And then what did we need? Uh, a titanium. Oh. Oh. Uh, that might be the problem. Do I have a singular piece of titanium anywhere? Or titanium alloy? I've got to have a singular piece of titanium. I thought we had one piece of titanium left. Oh, dear. There's zinc, data circuits, tungsten... Do I not have any titanium? I thought we had one piece of titanium left somewhere. Are you hungry, little friend? Hold on, I will feed you in a minute. Oh, darn. Maybe I don't have any titanium. Hold on, we're gonna go check the ground over here. Uh, we have a nanocarbon alloy, which is wild. Oh wait, hold on. There's titanium right there. We must've got titanium from the, um, from the event. Okay, that'll work. Oh man, whoo, that saved us right there. Oh no, he's not happy now. Okay, so titanium, that is our titanium alloy. Let's go ahead and make that. Now we have what we need for the ship. Let's go and get, uh, let's feed our, let's feed our little friend here, shall we? Not gonna lie, I kind of wish this thing would just eat organic or something. <laughs> like, I get it, it's cool. Um, but I get, you know what? I, there was comments, people saying that it can eat any seed. Okay, let's see, harvest. Boop. And then we'll go ahead and plant. And let's place you, guess what? Enjoy. Enjoy your snackity snack. Uh, no. I like that you can place them anywhere though. That makes them a super, a super handy light. Okay, so titanium alloy. Guess what, we've got it. All right, so what do we need now? Large shuttle. Medium shuttle? Oh, we, you know what? I guess it would help if we unlocked the thing, huh? We haven't even unlocked the shuttle yet. Large shuttle, 5,000. All right, so large shuttle, a ceramic. Boom. And two exochips. You know what? It's sad. <laughs> I feel like exochips are supposed to be the hard part of that recipe. <laughs> it, 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 it's not the hardest part. All right, so there's the large shuttle now okay so now we have a hydrogen thruster now we need to make hydrazine because we're gonna need hydrazine so hydrogen and ammonium all right so hydrogen wait hold on these are hydrogen right yes hydrogen and ammonium is gonna go in here there it is and we're gonna go ahead and re-enable that output and it can do its thing voila there it is this is making its thing that's making its thing we have the large shuttle folks ladies and gentlemen this happened it's amazing it's almost as amazing as this little board right here but it's not quite as amazing because this thing is amazing <laughs> let's be real all right let's put that away also people have uh, i saw comments in my last one because like obviously i love that board the vtol everyone is telling me that this vtol is uh, it feels like cheating because it's like purely creative flight so I cannot wait for that, but we cannot do, um, we can't do silicone, and I don't think we can do tungsten carbide yet. We're gonna have to see. I have a lot of tungsten, I have a lot of carbon. 
Um, but I'm not sure. So we need this thing because I can put my atmospheric condenser on here. And then we go to the other plants. We can grab some gases, all that fun stuff. Uh, look at all this hydrazine. Oh my gosh, it's amazing. I probably should get a container for that. I really should probably get a container for all of these as well. What do we have in here? Argon? Argon makes steel. I mean, we could turn a whole bunch of iron into steel right now if we needed to, but we don't really need to. I would like to get things cleaned up and organized a little bit. Um, I kind of want to make a bunch of these, but I just, I, you know, I like, I want to, but you know, we'll do that eventually. Oh, you know what? Also, I, I want to send off uh, this. I want to go ahead and send off this care package again. I Oh, everything fell off again. <laughs> we shall get all the infinite care packages. <laughs> I don't know why that keeps happening. I love it. Uh, but we're, <laughs> I don't know why it does that. And then let's see what's going on here. How come you're not? Uh, how come you're not? Do oh, wait. I mean, I could use a little bit more. I could use a little bit more research. I mean, we could always use more research, right? Absolutely. <laughs> Look at all these exochips. Absolutely everywhere. They are everywhere. There are so many exochips. I love it. All right, what do we got here? Okay, so we've got all those, and then another, is it another B? Oh, it's a D, D205. Oh wait, are we getting all D205s? Oh, we're all, we're getting only the Ds. Ah, uh, don't you hate it when you're only getting the Ds? I'd like the other ones, like there's some like Bs and Cs, but just the D for us. All right, well, that's, actually, I mean, we got some more graphite, so that's kind of handy. Uh, we got some soup, <laughs> that's funny, okay. Let's go ahead and let's see how this is going. Oh, our large shuttle is done. Okay, let's move this medium shuttle out of the way. You were fun, medium shuttle, but you are no longer needed. Oh, I'll take those chips out of there, though. That's for sure. All right, and then large shuttle. My gosh. Look at this bad boy. Oh, it's so gorgeous. It is so large and in charge. Uh, medium shredder. Very nice. All right, let's put you on here. And then let's go ahead and get our thruster because it's a hydrazine thruster. We're gonna go ahead and put that on here as well. And then what we're gonna do is we're actually gonna turn it this way and we're gonna do some, we're gonna have some, oh, you know what? We have the storage module on our Rover here. I actually wanna put that on here as well and have one slot with that. And I actually would like to do, uh, is hydrazine a gas? It is a fuel source. Uh, medium gas canister. Can hydrazine be stored in this? Or does it? It's not a nugget resource. It must be a liquid container, right? It's gotta be a liquid container of sorts. Medium resource canister, fluid and, okay, so that is probably what we want. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and turn that button the repeat off for now I'd like to get one of those because I want to basically have one that has full of hydrazine on our um, On here so we can just pop from the big tank throw it on here call it a day. Actually, you know what? Let's just do this. Let's grab these three We'll go ahead and throw the hydrazine on here one uh, two and a Three does it say how many launches? 24 24 launches. That's amazing. That is a wonderful time. We could go and pick up our, our uh, atmospheric condenser. We don't even have to go get a new one. We could just go pick up that one. Okay. Uh, we have some soup. Okay, so now a couple things that we need. Okay, so silicon. Would you... Okay, we're going to have to disable that output. Um, we need silicon. So we need methane. You know what we need to do? We need to go to Aatrox. We need to go to Aatrox and we need to get some gases there. Um, and then we need fluid and soil. Where's the gas canisters? So, so, oh, silicon and glass. Okay, yeah, we need to go to Aatrox. Aatrox is full of gases. <laughs> it is full of gas. Yeah, that's what we need to do. Let's do this. Let's go see, do we have enough for any more? Do I have any more titanium over here? Let's see, we have that one piece of titanium there. Do we get any more titanium from here? No. I need more titanium as well. 
Maybe that's something we should do. Should we take a trip to Vesania now? Because, like, we could. We could take a trip to Vesania. We could take a trip to, uh, to... Well, shoot. I guess we might as well. Uh, and then, wait, resource canister. Are you empty now? How many do you have? You have zero in here. Let's take this and go get titanium with it. I really kind of wish we had our gas thing, though, because I think there's a gas on Vesania that we need, too, isn't there? Hold on. Let's go to... Astropedia, planets, Vesania, hydrogen, argon, and nitrogen. Okay, so it has argon, I guess, um, which is handy, but we have, a, we, have, we have that. Novus has methane, but I believe, I want to say Aatrox has methane too. Yeah, Aatrox, see, Aatrox has helium, nitrogen, methane, and sulfur. Those are all really good resources that we need. So we need to take those with us as well. Uh, but we also are going to need power in order to do that. We have some QTRTGs. You know what? Let's do this first. Let's go to Vesania and let's go get some titanium. Let's start with that. Because we got our shuttle, we have hydrazine, but we need to get everything we need. We need more of those storage tower things anyways. So where is Vesania? Vesania. We're going to Vesania because I need more titanium. We are out of the titanium. There's something over here. There's something of, of note over here. Um, let's see, can we, is there anywhere to land that's close? I mean, I guess this one, we'll just land there then. And we'll just, I guess we can just cool, cool borders four on over there, right? <laughs> Pro skater three, let's do it. Let's make it happen, okay. So let's see, and I mean, we don't need oxygen because we have oxygen, we've got power. The only thing is we have to run with this, which we actually don't really have to do a whole lot with because all we have to do is like this. Oh, this is so nice. There's graphene or graphite. Okay, do we have any titanium? Oh. Oh, is that the thing? What is this? What is this thing? Oh. Oh, A. There's a Model A right there. There's an aluminum alloy. I will go ahead and take that. I don't think this is the thing, though. Is this the thing? Um. No, this is not the thing. The thing is over there. This is a cool thing, though. I like this thing. I want this thing. So we'll take that thing with us. But let's. I've never seen this platform before. Interesting platform. <gasps> There's some titanium down here. Okay, why am I... Why is this refusing to move? Now it's good. I don't know what... It's like it was like stuck underground or something. Uh, It doesn't look like there's very much titanium here. I guess we'll find out, won't we? Alright, it might have all been underground. Maybe. I lied. There's. It doesn't look like there's much titanium in here at all. Nope, okay. Moving on to the next source. Oh, oh, it's right here. Oh, it's another, oh goodness. It's another, um, it's another mat, a material analyzer thing. Okay, I'm not actually gonna mess with that right now. We're gonna leave Matt alone. Um, I would like to find more titanium though. That's, that's our goal right now. Like I said, we're gonna try to just focus on the goal at hand. Goal at hand, more titanium. You know, I gotta say, I'm not actually very good at finding this. Oh, you know, I just realized another thing that we could also do is we could get another thruster. We could get a, uh, we could get a hydrazine thruster now. Here's another little tiny thing of titanium. Is there any more in here? My titanium finding is not going very well. I thought it was up in the mountains, like... Like, I thought it was up there in those mountains areas, but I haven't found a whole lot of it. All right, so let's go ahead and throw this on here. That is our titanium. 
I guess there's a little bit here. There's not a ton here, though. This is a very shallow and not dense node. All right, we're going up in the mountains. I'm telling you. I think there's more titanium up in these hills. I think maybe I need to just slow down. <laughs> maybe I need to slow down and look around. Maybe that'll help me find it. Hey, there we go. Okay, here we go. This is much, much better. This is what I'm talking about. All uh, right, let's get rid of this thwacky plant. Can I feed you this? Will you will you happily eat this thing? I think it will. I just don't think it'll give me the full like 30 minute timer. Okay. All right, we're gonna go ahead and grab all this. This is what I was talking about. This is what I needed right here. This actually might be a. This might be more than one um, deposit in an area. And lucky for us, everything's rolling to one spot, which is great. <laughs> There's so much titanium here. I love it. Oh, we're gonna have storages for days. Oh my gosh, it just keeps going. There's so much titanium here. This is like an Uber node. This this node is. We're not gonna have enough storage for this node. <laughs> This node is so big. We're at 25 of 32. I think we're going to get a solid 32 out of this one node alone. I don't think it's going to even be an issue. <laughs> uh, Yeah, that's crazy. Yep, yeah, we're already at 31. And there's 32. Hold on a second. There. Maybe. Like, we literally can't even hold anymore. That's crazy. 32 titanium out of one spot? That's it's full 32 nuggets. I can't even believe that Um, okay, well Let's go ahead and We're gonna head back to the uh We're gonna head back to our shuttle now. Oh my gosh. I can't even believe that Ow, he slapped me don't slap me. That's not nice. Oh There's oh my gosh. There's more titanium right here. <laughs> Oh goodness, we got hit by that? Ooh, we almost died there. That I feel like we were really close to that one. Oh goodness. Okay, we're gonna try to get we're trying to get away from here. Let's not die. Oh, I don't wanna die. Alright, we're good. We made it. Oh my gosh, that's crazy. Uh yeah, that is literally all I needed here. That is a full thing of titanium, which is wonderful. That's gonna allow us to do all kinds of things. So let's go ahead and enter this bad boy. And uh, I'm trying to decide if we need to go to do we go to Vasenia to grab the the yeah you know what let's mind it we might as well we're gonna go to Vasenia grab our atmosphere condenser so we can go ahead and make some more gases we're gonna throw that on here uh we are gonna need power though to power it and I do have we have a decent amount of the little um I left it on Glacial, right? I'm pretty sure it's on Glacial. Uh, we have a decent amount of the little QTRTGs, but we need more of them. Okay, where did we land at? We were over here. Pretty sure we were like right here somewhere. Yep, and look at that, there it is. Oh my gosh. Uh, I should have brought a gas thing with me because we have all those gas nodes right there. What do, we, okay, uh, we don't have, let's see, oh, I'm taking, I'm taking you. This QTRTG is coming with me. <laughs> You're coming with me, I need you. Get in my, oh, I don't have a backpack slot. All right, so we've got that. Um, this is gonna go on here, like that, look at that. And we're gonna go ahead and tell it to stop. And then let's see. So we have those two. That's it. That's all the slots I have. I don't have any more open slots right now because we have aluminum alloy, titanium, the circuit. Oh, I don't need soup. Why do I got soup on me? We'll take this argon with us too. Okay. So now that we have that, let's go ahead and head to. We have iron already. So we're solid here. Let's go ahead and head back to Silva. Oh my gosh. This is so nice being able to just like bolt it, just going from planet to planet without having to worry about like thrusters and stuff all the time. That is a win. All right, so Silva. And then we're going to go ahead and get the storage module for this. Now, I'm trying to decide at what storage module we actually want. Because there's... A, 
We could, you know, I know which one we're going to get. We know which, we, we all know which one we're actually going to go for here. Because we need storage, we need storage -ception. We need storage upon storage, which is literally what we're going to do. We are going to have storage upon storage. So let's see, is this home? Home base. <laughs> storage upon storage. <laughs> there is only one thing that can give us that. Well, there's actually a couple things. There's a couple ways to do it, but the thing I'm thinking of is what are our uh, mission reward completion? Oh, I hope that uh, it's this guy right here, the large storage silo B3 steel for that. That is what we're going to go with because we have the iron. We have the argon. We have the things needed. So uh, wait, hold on. Where'd the argon go? There should be we should have a little canister of argon. Are you argon? You know what? I'm just going to throw it right there. Oh, you little turd. Okay, we're going to set that over there. All right, so there's Argon. Uh, so steel. We need three steel. So I just need six iron. That's easy enough. So we'll go ahead and throw those on there. Grab this. Steel. Oh, no, it's carbon. It's carbon. Oh, guess what? We have an infinite supply of carbon over here. One. A. Two. A three. We need Oh, we only need three. And there's one steel. And we'll go ahead and grab another iron. So there's the other two that we need. Go ahead and throw that back on here. Throw that back on there. Let's go ahead and grab this out of here. Because that is all titanium, baby. Uh, we probably should go ahead and smelt this down, actually. Yeah, let's go ahead and smelt this down. I'm going to put one on the smelter. Throw that on there. Throw this here. All right, so that can all do its thing. I'm going to turn that on. Oh, wait. Yeah, we're going to have to let it do its thing like this. All right, we'll just leave it there. It'll figure it out. Maybe. So there's one steel. And this is the big boy. Oh, is it not in there? It must be in here. There you are. Oh, this is this is a good one. This is a good one because you can put this on there and then you get how many storage slots is it on each one? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Is it 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15? It's like 15 double slots, which if you put then the tight the, the if you put these on there, like you have <laughs> insane amount of storage. Insane amount of storage. We'll we will we'll never lack for storage again. Um, it will never happen. <laughs> and then there's that. Go ahead and print that bad boy. <laughs> it's fantastic. I'm so excited. Uh really need how many more do you have? Good gosh! There's so much in there. You know what? I'm gonna go ahead and grab that titanium. We're gonna grab titanium. Oh, we have two titanium. All right, let's get a uh, let's get another silo going here. A storage silo. This is one of my favorite storages of all times because it is just so handy. It has so many individual little slots. It can just it can just pick up so many different. It's it's just so good. It is a really good little thing to have. So we're gonna put this over here so it can fill up uh with stuff as well so we're gonna go ahead and put that there i'm gonna grab this we're gonna go we're gonna grab this put this there open that up then it can store more things and then i can go ahead and grab this throw these on here we can throw this on here unload it uh there we go so there it goes doing its thing and then once it's done we'll pull it off we'll put the titanium on there and then it can suck up all the titanium as well, so we'll disable storage, put the titanium on there, grab this, throw that, and it'll pull everything off, and voila. There's our titanium being smelted and stored. Wonderful. We'll throw that on there. Oh, 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 oh baby. <gasps> Let's, oh no, it doesn't. It only has what? Oh, that's right, it's, it's not. I forgot the blue side. So it's got a total of 12 double slides. That's still so much more than we need. Nobody needs this amount of storage and I love it. Oh, but I need it so bad. Guess what? There it is. We have so much storage now. It's fantastic. It's just so good. It's just so good. All right, so let's get this guy. Uh, Where did that go? Did I not print one of those? Oh, I used it. I was, <laughs> I'm losing my mind here. I was like, where did it go? It's I used it. It's it's right here. I'm going to take two of these. 
disable that put that back on there we're gonna get another one going uh we're gonna throw probably another one on there i really should do something with all the stuff on the ground too okay so here's another uh storage silo so now we can throw that this is this is where it, look at this tell me that's not ridiculous like it's ridiculous and i love it it's ridiculous for all the right reasons it absolutely is ridiculous for all the right reasons so we're gonna go ahead and um i need to throw some power on here now we could look what is our top tier power generating source right is the rtg um a nano carbon alloy and a lithium i don't have lithium yet Lithium, I believe, is in is in is lithium in the caves of Vasenia. Uh, hold on, let's go in here. Planets, Vasenia, lithium. Yes. Okay. So the caves of Vasenia has lithium. Um, who? Else? Well, hold on a second. Novus has lithium in the mountains. Hmm. It would be nice to get that going. Uh, the only reason I say that is because we do have a nanocarbon alloy right here. So we could make one of those RTGs and those RTGs produce four U's. That's actually quite terrible. Considering. Uh, that is actually quite terrible. Considering we can use well, okay, it, I mean, it's not terrible, but there's a definitely there's definitely a better way of power storage here. Where is the, hold on a second, I'm looking for, where's the QTRTG? Am I missing something here? Oxygen tanks, filters, tethers. Where's the power stuff? Right here, okay. Can you not craft the QTRTG? Is that a thing that's non-craftable? What? What? Is the QTRTG not a craftable item? No. Are you serious? Hold on a second. There's no way. Glow sticks, floodlight. Am I missing this? Small generator power cells, small solar, small wind, small battery. Where's the QTRTG for one nan nanocarbon alloy? Is that not a thing? Are you serious? Okay, leave a comment down. If I'm, is that seriously not craftable? What? I, I'm at a loss for words. This used to be craftable for one nanocarbon alloy. And the whole thing was amazing because you would, you would get these, you would load up these things and each one of these generates one U of power. So you have four, you have eight, you have 12, you have 24 U's of power per two power slots. This was an insane thing. You would throw these on the back of a, ro a rover and go and activate all your big purple things. Is that seriously no longer a craftable item? Available as rewards from Exodynamics or rarely found in Rex? What? Oh my gosh. I can, I'm just, I'm a, I am absolutely at a loss for words. I can't believe that. I am just... I, I don't even know what to say. I don't even know what to say. I have no idea what to say. I'm going to... Mm. What happened? Where did they go? Okay, we're going to throw this on here. We're going we're gonna to resend this again. And look, everything falls off and we get it back. I love it so much. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm, just, I'm completely at a loss right now because I still thought that was 100% a craftable item for a nanocarbon. I was like, okay, well, we could craft it with a nanocarbon. Um, but the nanocarbon that you craft it with is, you know, it's only worth one power instead of four. I'm, hmm. This is, this is disgusting. This needs cleaned up. I'm going to have to spend some time cleaning up this up at some point. I'm still just at a loss for it. I can't even, I didn't know that was no longer a craftable item. What did we get? Did we get anything good? <laughs> we got, we got another D. Oh, I'm so excited. Did we get tungsten from that? Yeah, we got tungsten and titanium from that. That's actually kind of cool. Um, alrighty then. Well, that's interesting to say the least, but we do have, we have this guy. Um, this draws 20 use power while active. Oh, that's going to be interesting. So I want to see you guys, you guys produce nine. Hmm. I'm not gonna lie. I was kind of thinking we were just going to fill these up with, with these little power deals, but 
you know, I don't know. Um, hold on. You know what? We might actually have some more rewards too. So hydrazine thrust. Oh, wow. We got a hydrazine thruster for making fuel. Um, find the stadium data, blow up recorder, retrieve an exo chip, uh, vertical thinking. Okay. And then what is this one? Print a rail post bundle. Okay. So we need to do that. We still have a whole bunch of stuff here. Mm. Very interesting. At least we have an extra hydrazine thruster, which is, uh, that'll be nice. We'll go throw that over here. Uh, just in case our ship blows up or something, I guess we'll have one. I'm not going to have it on me, though, so it's not going to be uber useful. Actually, you know what we really should do? We really should dig to the core of the planet, activate the planetary core, and then activate with these beacons because we can use these beacons to then get to the core, and then we can use the core to get to other cores of other planets and use those cores to get to the beacons. You know what I mean? So if we ever get lost on the... If we ever get trapped on a planet, all we really have to do is activate the, um, the stuff. But I don't know. Hmm, interesting. But that's going to end this episode. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you did like, subscribe, all the fun things. We got a large shuttle. We are ready for interplanetary travel and exploration shenanigans. Uh, I am still just flabbergasted that we don't have a craftable art QTRTG. Um, I actually, at the time, I don't even remember it being called a QTRTG. I think it was just called like a mini RTG or just RTG. I don't know. That's amazing, though. Leave a comment. Let me know what you guys think. And I will see you in the next one. Bye, everybody.